Many houses at Ikbe community are built with bamboo wood and roofed with raffia palms, just as peculiar to other riverine enclaves. Building houses with bamboo wood and raffia palms in riverine communities is as old as man because of the unique stamina to absorb the wear and tear of water and mud. Bamboo is a distinct group of evergreen plants which is one of the global fastest growing plants. Certain species of bamboo can grow up to 910 mm within a 24-hour period. The rapid growth and tolerance for barely unproductive lands makes bamboo a good option for afforestation, carbon separation and climate change mitigation. In Nigeria, bamboo can be used for scaffolding, yam bonds, soil erosion control, firewood and the construction of huts, which is replicated right here at Ikpe community as most of the huts have been constructed with bamboo. The Okaigele of Ikpe community, Victor Okopian, says they construct their houses with bamboo because of its durability and ability to withstand tension occasioned by global warming and other ecological challenges. They cut bamboo, which is this as well the season. Now bamboo, now one hand with the door. So we use at the build house, at the house where they stay. They might always say cold, they affect us all the time. Indigens of Ikbe community are skilled mat and broom makers and also engage in palm wine tapping. Just like in the Urubu speaking part of Delta State, which is where indigens of Ikbe community migrated from in 1933, the locally made gin called Ugogoro is distilled and sold to make a living. I'll go first go breed the palm if I don't come for a palm, I can go find firewood. I can put it put for the oven. This local refinery. When you don't put the palm, the can can go come out before you cut it. After that one come out, you can retrieve it back and again for the drum before the original can can go come out. For some individuals who have a phobia for water, this particular exercise that I am actually undergoing might seem pretty scary. This, however, cannot be the case for indigenous of Ikbe community, as one of their major sources of livelihood is fishing. Their easy access to the river makes the people skillful swimmers, fishermen and women. They are also very talented in making fish traps and nets. I make it for fish. Yes. I mean, we try for river, the key fish, they get money. One of the oldest fishermen in the community sets out to retrieve his fish traps. But it seems the fishers had other plans as he returns unsuccessfully. <laughs> Living on top of water may come with its advantages, but during the rainy season, local residents of Ikbe community are faced with the problem of flood, which destroys their property. Every year, that water they disturb us for year. Then this one comes for life to another fisherman. When the river have a flow, like at we see Diana, sometimes if the river flow like that September, we they cook along the road because water they enter the house. We say if we the male they swim they enter inside. We also we not feel die for the river because and also our children now we try to pretend we put the first canoe. Malaria, fever, cholera and other waterborne diseases are the major illnesses residents of Ikbe community are regularly faced with. When such cases arise, they have to travel long distances to access health care as there is currently no health center in the community. With a good belief for the take treatment, they said not be here at all at all. So if one by mercy with the pick transport to them. Children of Ikbe community also have to travel long distances to access functional education as there is no school in the community. They are also faced with lack of electricity. Besides this, security is a major challenge as kidnapping, both on land and on water, is rampant. School not there yet, but with the pay transport, they go with Dogbo, they will go beneath. Uh -huh. So also our children, with the carry motor they give them. Because once they make our children, they go to school. But without school, there's nothing you can do for Nigeria. Come back 
Fishing, fish net making, mat making, construction of bamboo houses, farming, and of course, palm wine tapping. The diversity of handwork and skills possessed by indigenous of Ikpe community makes it an economic hub. But with so many challenges, the residents here can only hope for more development. From Ikbe Riverside in Ikbe Baoka, local government area of Edo State, and Meze or Bais Yagun reporting.